Hello and welcome, my name is Josh and this is TechZone. I've got another video for you today, not the Raspberry Pi, but I'm coming back to the antivirus software. You may have um, remembered that I did a video on my favourite software for antivirus and anti-malware. And I'm going to do a full review of each and every one of them, which is... Uh, the today's one we're going to line up is CCleaner by Pryform. Not the recycle bin, not even the Raspberry Pi, why am I doing that? And we're going into my bugs folder. Open up CC Cleaner, and well not CC Cleaner, C Cleaner. And what you can do with this, you can, as I said, you can clean your computer of any dead ra uh, registry, cache, and any, um, especially for Windows Explorer, if you use Windows Explorer, which I recommend you don't use, I, um, Windows X, yeah, Windows Explorer, the, um, I would use. Google Chrome if I were you. So how you use it, all you have to do is click Analyze. And because I've already done this before, you literally run the cleaner and it speeds your computer up. Like that. Easy. But there are some hidden features of C Cleaner, such as registry. You may have not known that, so you can scan for issues. So already I've already done this um a couple days ago, but think when you're deleting things and changing programs, you're, the registry is still left. So if you make the effort to go into this and check out your registry, it could speed up your computer quite significantly. Obviously, because I haven't got many issues because um, I did this the other day. But if that's how much you get just up from a couple days, think of how much you've had for a couple years. So it is worth going out and checking it out. So. Next, you also have tools. You have a range worth of tools. You get an uninstall tool, which you may think, oh, I've already got the uninstall through the contr control panel. I would use this more. The reason why is that it has also uninstall, repair, rename, and delete. Delete is the most important one I find that I use. The thing is, you can delete this straight from the registry, so it means that you're not going to have to change that registry. And um, if you've ever gone into your C uh, drive, and you've deleted something and you go oh god it's still there but it's not it's actually just a blank file and it's quite annoying and it's quite nice to get rid of everything and keep it in uh, in place so the next thing you have is a startup tool the startup tool means that you just go through all the applications that run when you start up so this allows me to check um, what um, programs are you being used when I start up the computer so things like elite motion control and one well, no, I don't use these hardly so why does I need it why do I need it so that's why I get rid of it so using it by doing that you you're just saving time and I'm running an SSD and a one terabyte hard drive in a duo drive uh, called, called an SSHD which I, I love it's brilliant speedier but obviously you want to crank out the most from this so getting every second counts so also you can check what's uh, being used in uh, Internet Explorer which I never use Google Chrome is my main one that I always use schedule tasks I leave this because I use all of these and um, contact menu uh, second uh, next you've got file finder that's really good for um, finding files that you need specifically so you can filter it down I, I don't really use it much so I'm not really gonna go in much into depth and if I don't really use it much you're probably not gonna use it much there's other programs out there and you can even use it through the um, Windows experience you can use a system restore which it's brilliant because if you've got rid of something then you go oh I need that back such as I got rid of Prezi the other day I could bring that back the other day I could bring that back um, drive wiper wouldn't really use you can do this within um, your Windows experience start button so not really much of a useful tool but obviously it's there which is great my overall review of this is one of my favorite tools and it's a must-have for all computers even if it hasn't got all the full features but if you are quite new to computers use this tool it's easy to learn there's tons of reviews out on YouTube. I'm not going to go through the full review, but it's easy. Just click Analyze, Run Cleaner, you've cleaned your computer, check your registry out once in a while, and use a tool if you think that your computer is slow. That's me, Josh from TechZone. 
Stay tuned for the next video. I'm signing out. Goodbye.